Solar Prime has been in operation for about what? Oh, 15 months, Crystal? Uh, I think you're right. I just started. We opened up during. Started. started. Yeah. Oh, no, we started. Right. 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 What is that? Solar Prime Corporation. We became incorporated. Oh, Solar Prime. Okay, Solar Prime. We became incorporated about 15 minutes ago. We started the concept months before that. It's almost two years. It's a bit of a learning curve, man. We went to Rumble, <laughs> then had some good successes. And I was a little, I had a little, you know, apprehensive, but I wasn't nervous. I was uh, working along with uh, Lisa. She was great. She actually, because Alex was busy with her. They're trying to do their job. They're trying to tell us. But thank God, due to the fact that she works here, mm -hmm. she was great for us. Helping me, telling me what to do. Actually, we ended up being in the room <laughs> by ourselves because he had to go and do something else. But you know, I didn't know that they had to prepare the trays because most hospitals that I've been in, you know, the kitchen does the trays. You know, the downtown is like, what are you doing? We got to go and prepare these plates, take them to the residents. I truly enjoy feeding mm -hmm. uh, the residents. I really yeah. enjoy that, you know, you have to take time and cut their food up and eat, make sure they eat it. And I noticed my, uh, the resident didn't like a lot of water. Today mm -hmm. too. Have you guys okay. But I, then again, I don't know what, what it was it was you say. Did they better than your first day? Um, actually, I'm enjoying both days. Um, to be honest, it's just was more patience today than it was yesterday. But I'm definitely enjoying. I feel like I was at work. Like I didn't feel like a student today. Of course. At, oh, I feel like I was at work. Of course. And you know, really it's so funny you say that because I just told my daughter, I'm at work. I can't talk to you. But that's what it feels like. It feels like you're at work. Mm -hmm. yeah. We all were pretty nervous this morning, but once we got on the floor, I was, like, I was so nervous. <laughs> I thought you were adapted instantly, like right. you had no choice. Right. Oh, but to adapt. Yeah, mm -hmm. I was a little, I had a little, you know, apprehensive, but I wasn't nervous. I was. Uh, I'm Ms. Doris Kent and I'm from Washington, D.C. I am here for the Summa Prime um, CNA courses that you guys offered. I actually um, heard about this uh, particular course from my sister. She actually sent me a text. Um, this is something that I just looked at and was like, okay, well, let me try it out. And um, me trying it out, I absolutely love it. Okay, my name is Patrice Jones. My parents are Washingtonians. So I was raised in um, the District of Columbia. Going through this program, how it would benefit my family and what I have recognized that would be beneficial for someone else is changing the family dynamics. As a teen mom, I struggled financially and there was a lot of hardship that I encountered as a teen mom, as a single mom, as a black woman. Um, living within poverty in the District of Columbia. There were so many things I had to do to make ends meet. So establishing a career and a certain lifestyle can relieve stress. It can um, create an environment that is more enjoyable for a person's lifespan. It can create opportunities. Um, just, just a different family dynamics for your, your children or your loved ones, your spouses, and a sense of comfort. My name is Lima Mtewa. The classes that I took, the most interesting part was the clinical part for me because I can interact with the residents and stuff. So the most interesting part that I found out about myself is I'm compassionate, I care, and I like the fact, the, the way the resident felt after we visited them and took care of them and the way they felt afterwards they were happy and they were content with the service that we provided so I like that a lot. My experience with the Summa Prime healthcare team has been phenomenal. Um, Dr. White has been amazing. She really helps you to understand the curriculum so that you can actually retain the information and that was one problem that I thought I would have. After I finish the class and get my certificate as CNA, I will be working at Forest Hills, and then I would um, hopefully I could get into the um, apprenticeship program and do the advanced CNA program and continue my nursing career as an RN. I want to become an RN, and hopefully one day I do want to open my own practice. 
My plans after I finish the program and pass the state boards is to continue my education and further um, my skill set and enroll in school so that I can become a nurse. Are you all looking forward to doing this in the next couple of well, next Six weeks, we'll be on the floor. If I can get these knees and my feet uh -huh. together, then yes, I'm all for it. I'm, I'm thinking about doing yeah. this for the first couple months, but yeah. then I'm trying to go to the hospital because I really want to go to the Navy and be their nurse. Really? Yeah. yeah, so I just gotta work got my way up. That's good. That's right, we got goals. Well, I'm well, definitely gonna plan on working here, but <laughs> my ultimate goal is to be in the school in January, headed for the LPN. Oh, right. we, we are, are super, super proud. We are Super Prime!